to the left of the call button is going to be your messages button. If you tap on that, this is the text message section. And if you'd like to send someone a message, you're going to tap on the bubble in the bottom right corner. And then you will uh, see a keyboard pop up and you can type in the person's name if they're already saved in your phone or you can uh, enter just the phone number. Now a quick shortcut, if you tap on this button here, this is your dialer or your keypad, it will switch it to make it easier for you to input just a phone number. Let's put that same number in and then we'll hit done. So now we've basically set it up so we're gonna text that number. Our keyboard has come up. We're now in the text message section at the bottom here and I can now enter a message. Hi there. And when I'm ready to send it, I can tap on the button here, which is the send button. Now here's a few more things you can do in terms of sending text messages. You have an emoji button here. This will bring up your uh, emojis. You can send someone a picture. For example, if someone says, you know, goodbye, you can send uh, a wave like this and hit the send button. And now you've just sent someone a wave emoji. If I tap on the button here, this will allow me to attach a picture to the email. So you'll have two options. You'll have a camera option, which is, hey, let's take a picture right now. I'm gonna just hold it up and tap on the white circle. That's gonna take a picture that I can attach immediately to the text message, or I can go to my gallery right here and look at what pictures are saved on the phone. Let's say I wanna send this picture. I'm gonna tap on it, tap on add. And now I've attached two pictures to this text message and I'm gonna hit this button to send it. Now, that's not all. There's a few more things you can do as well. If you tap on the plus all the way to the left, you can look for a GIF if you'd like to send them one of those funny animated pictures. You can also send stickers. You can attach different types of files, not pictures, but maybe like a document. You can send your location in case you're trying to show someone how to find you. You can attach a contact or you can even schedule a message to be sent later by selecting here. You also have uh, two microphones on the screen. One is here and one is here. The, key, the microphone at the bottom here will allow you to say what you want your message to say and it will type it for you. It will dictate it. So watch this. Tap on the microphone. Let's hit skip. Tap while using. Agree. It's now going to make you press it again. Good morning, I hope you're feeling well today. And basically, it just typed out everything I said into the message, and all I have to do is hit the send button to send out that message. Now, this microphone is a different option. This is if you'd like to send someone a voice message, you can tap here and um, basically say a verbal message and have that sent to them. But you'll need to take your finger and hold down on the button. It will record as long as you're holding down on the button and then it will stop recording once you lift your finger like this. Good morning, I hope you're feeling well today. So it just created a three second voice message that I can now send in the message. So these are just a few of the things you can do um, in terms of text message. If you found the video helpful, hit that like button down below. If you wanna learn more about this phone, check out one of the videos on the screen. And if you wanna save money on your phone bill, check out the link in the description to see how you can get unlimited high-speed internet for just $30 a month. Thanks again for watching. Take care and as always, have a good one.